up you guys, this is Yugi L and today I am going to train some fish with another local breeder in uh, racing his uh, business is called Shimways Cichlids and More Alright folks, so the trade went through uh, Shumway, he's a really, really cool guy. He just started one year ago and he's already having a lot of fantastic fish and projects and a lot of uh, fish tanks um, due to the pandemic. I did not go inside because I know my wife would kill me. I don't want to bring anything bad to the family. Especially during uncertainty times, if any way I could prevent it. But the fish is right here. Boom! Come on, baby. Let me take him out so you guys can see them. But he hooked me up with this big female too. Check that out. Wow. You know, as a female, she looks pretty beautiful already. And Shumwe said that uh, she bred twice already, which is a good thing. So she's a proven breeder. So I can't wait to for her to breed with my big male and then check it out the trouts so five trouts Damn! two inches uh, so these fish I've always been contacting DNA cichlids about you know getting some trouts from them these trouts are actually from their breeding group and you know I, I got I got some messages that I could show you guys back then. I was about to trade too as well. Trade my uh, Bukunotos for them. It never went through. So I'm happy that it was able to go through with uh, Shumway. Let's put them in. Let's uh, acclimate them first. This big old female. You are gonna breed with this big old male, so I'm gonna put you in here. There you go. Yeah, if you can check it out, this female is really big compared to these other three. So one is holding. She's hiding. But one is holding right here. This one's holding right there. She's not hiding, actually. Females are... Uh, one right here from the local fish store and two from the Snake River Cichlids. I got the five trouts right here. Gonna acclimate them for 10 minutes. They're gonna be living with the Sunshine Peacocks. OB Peacock female over here. She was actually holding, you can see her egg tube right there. Um, but uh, when he caught her, she I think she spat them all out so I'm thinking the other peacocks ate all the eggs uh, which is fine I'm pretty sure she's gonna breed again these other two females they haven't bred yet so she has so that's a good sign already who knows maybe my OB male is gonna detect it and want to breed but uh, I'm pretty excited for him hopefully he breeds he is the king of the tank right now I did move all those bigger OB females to put it in my other tank because I know that this dude is more mellow. My sunshine, predominant male, might just grow up to dominate him. So I hope he better uh, take control of this tank. And I just released them. Let's check them out. These trolls. Looking fantastic. I noticed that they all got black marks on the tip of their uh, mouth, like on the bottom. You guys see that? Let's see if this camera can zoom in. Two weeks later, and here is the update on the trials. size is around 2 inches to 2.5 here's the big guy right here they're getting their size on this guy could be a male some of them are still kind of small but compared to my finger 2 inch marks like around 
right there by my line, second line. Yeah, that one's smaller. This one's I don't know, two point five right there. That guy. Compare them to my Sunshine Peacock. All right, folks. So that's the update on the Malawi trouts. Uh, their scientific name is called the Champsochromus corallius. Um, they're the same family as the Champsochromus uh, spilohinchus, but the uh, spilohinchus is a little bit more bigger, rounder, and wider, uh, in my opinion. The trouts, uh, they they do grow pretty big. They grow to around 12 to 15 inches as well. Get pretty, they get pretty thick themselves, but mine is still too small. Uh, they're not gonna be anytime soon. Maybe in one year, uh, one will start to color up. But I'll keep you guys updated. I'm glad I, I uh, keep them now. Uh, they join all my other haps. Uh, as you guys know, or if you don't know, uh, I keep four haps: uh, the Bucunodos, the Venustas, the Autoframes Tetrastigma, and the um, Tyrannochromus nigraventris. So the trouts will make it my fifth. That's my fifth type of haps. And if you guys don't know already as well, uh, I don't want to keep too much tanks. I don't want to breed too much fish. I just want to breed my favorites. So uh, the trouts are one of my favorites. So I'm glad that uh, I'm going to stick to them. They're going to be my new breeding groups. For peacocks, uh, I only keep two types. Uh, the Sunshine Peacocks and the Obi Peacock. Thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. That way you guys stay updated on my fish keeping journey. Don't forget to like this video. And uh, stay tuned for the next one. So peace out. I'm out of here. Oh.